This is the new HP Stream Mini Desktop, Mini PC. It just came today, and as you see, it's the box is not not really that big. It the, it was on the HP website the first time I saw it was on January the 15th it appeared I checked again later that night after 12 and it was able I was able to purchase one at first I was not able to purchase one um, so I should have one of the very first ones that rolled off the line I did not get the uh, two-day shipping, but it did come fairly quickly. This is January the 21st. And I did notice a couple days ago that it's out of stock. So either they didn't make a lot of them or they went really fast. This is the first unboxing I've ever done, and so I'll see what I can do here. So this is the way it came from FedEx. Okay, that's the computer. That's probably the power, maybe the mouse. And I'm sure this is the keyboard. So the keyboard is about the biggest thing here. Okay, I'm taking the thumb off the computer, pulling it out of the bag. So that is the computer. It doesn't look like much, but and it does a Celeron. It's got two gigabytes of RAM and 32 gigabytes of of hard uh, of solid state hard drive. It's got four USB, two USBs in the back. I think they're 3.0 and two in the front. SS, I think that stands for super speed. It's got a HDMI and a display sport, display, display port. I've seen it um, driving two monitors at a time, but I think one monitor is probably all I'll ever be using it for. Okay, and here's the little card reader on the on the side here. Okay, Let's see what's in this box. Power supply looks pretty much like it. A laptop power supply and a a mouse and it's a wired mouse and the keyboard is also a USB keyboard I think with the higher end versions, and HP does make some more expensive version, it, uh, you can actually get a wireless or a Bluetooth mouse and keyboard. Okay. Yeah, full size keyboard. 
I should say that the reason probably this is going so fast is it's for $100, $180. This is my, probably not good for a first computer, but for a second computer, I'm hoping it's going to be a, just what we need. And for $180, it's hard to, hard to go wrong. I'm kidding. So those are all the pieces that that were in the box. All we have to do now is start plugging it up. Well, let's turn it on and see what happens here. I'm using a uh, 32 inch TV that I had. I'll probably get a, a proper monitor one of these days. But I had this handy and it is HDMI so I thought it would work. Okay, I guess I'll accept. Like I mentioned before, there is only 32 gigabytes of hard drive storage on this little little thing, but they do give you 200 gigabytes of OneDrive storage up in the cloud. So you can use that. I was also going to hook an external hard drive up to that and the USB 3 using the USB 3 port. I have skipped a bunch of the personal screens getting this thing going and let's see what happens next. Okay, setting up your account. Finalizing your settings. Hi. Okay, hi. <laughs> We're setting things up for you. You can get new apps from the store. Installing your apps. I'm not sure what apps it's talking about. Let's start. Hmm. Connected drive, connected music, connected photo, HP Spark Fram, Cap McAfee, Priceline, and Picture. Windows 8 with Bing. Okay, yeah, this is a Windows machine. For $180, it's probably the, one of the cheapest window machines around. 